Hello, my name is Ederson Oliveira and I'll be presenting this video for DNNHero.com and in this video I'll be covering the first topic that I have chosen to talk about SEO uh, in in terms of .NET Nuke. So, um, in, the, in this particular topic that I'm going to cover today is about the uh, friendly URLs in .NET Nuke. That is a key element for the whole SEO strategy that you should take uh, when dealing with uh, a .NET Nuke website. Now, as you can see, I have here a, a DNN 544 uh, test site installed. And if I, for instance, if I go to the homepage link, I'll see the URL home.aspx. So this is already not only an SEO, um, a search engine friendly uh, URL, but it's also a human friendly URL. So uh, this is an out of the box installation of the community edition of DNN 544. But if by any chance uh, you are running a DNN uh, website and your URLs, when you click, when you browse through the menus, if they are not showing up uh, close to this, and by this I mean the page name uh, in the menu is reflected in the in the page URL as well, uh, there might be a couple of reasons why this is not happening. So uh, I'm going to cover some of the possible reasons why uh, in your particular case, uh, the page might not be showing up with friendly URLs. So uh, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to log in to the back end of the site as host because I'm going to switch some options off so we can see a possible scenario that you may be going through right now. So if I go to under host, host settings, and I scroll down and go to friendly URLs, Maybe in your case, uh, this option is uh, switched off. So if I switch this off and I click update, oops, this should have a dot com somewhere. That's fine. Just click update again. And if I go to the home page, you see now, now you no longer see a, a friendly URL uh, on uh, on the home page. You see a question mark and then a a, a question. Uh, parameter called tab ID equals to 40. 40 is actually the the ID of the home page uh, page. Now, again, if your site is showing up like this, like default question mark tab ID equals to 40, very simple. Just have to undo what I have done right now. Go to host settings and then make sure that we have that you have uh, use friendly URLs checked. By doing so and clicking update, we go back to the friendly uh, URL at the top. So again, uh, you may you may have gotten this problem because maybe you are upgrading your site from an older version of uh, .NET Nook, or maybe you just have an older version of .NET Nook and you want to see how you can go about uh, uh, making uh, friendly URLs. Now, again, this is an out of the box solution from .NET Nook. There are Lots of modules out there that will also help you out in terms of uh, making, uh, creating a friendly uh, URLs. One of those uh, modules is called Affinity, and I have another video covering Affinity, which I'm going to post the link in this video uh, post as well. Now I'm going to show another scenario that is also uh, a possibility that you are going through right now. So let's say that if you have, you already have switched on different URLs, but your URLs for the home page or for any other page is not showing up like nicely like this yet. Um, so there is another possibility that you uh, of another uh, set that may be switched off in your uh, website. And I'm going to show this other possibility right now. It might be the case that uh, there is a parameter missing in your web config file for your website. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to open uh, the root folder of my site. So here's the root folder of my site. I'm running from the uh, local host, so I'm browsing through Windows Explorer. Uh, here's my site. Here's the root folder. I'm just going to open the web config. Okay, so I have the web config open, and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to search for a uh, an entry in the web config called DNN friendly URL, and in this case, in, under the add entry, 
I'm going to search for the to look for the URL format. In this case, uh, the URL format is set to human friendly. That's the reason why we are seeing the URLs uh, readable as as uh, a person will read that. I have in this case home.aspx, but in case uh, this parameter is not present, and I'm going to just give an example right now, I'm going to delete this parameter, I'm going to save it, I'm going to refresh the site. So now the URL is looking a little bit different. We, I still have home here, but then I have tab ID, and then I have 40, and then I have default.spx, which, again, it's it's a bit friendly, but not that friendly, not that, uh, it's not human friendly. It can still be a bit of SEO friendly as well, but it would be much better in terms of SEO and even in terms of, of people reading the, the page that uh, we keep the human friendly parameter. So in case you are seeing in your pages something close to this, it's most likely because uh, there is a, a parameter, there is the URL, the URL format human friendly missing under the DNN friendly uh, URL entry in the web config. So again, we just have to put it to put the parameter there. And once I save this and I refresh the page, then now I see home.spx, a very simple URL, uh, very good for not only SEO but for humans as well. So this is basically just the, the first aspect that I want to cover that I wanted to cover in terms of uh, the SEO uh, strategy that you should uh, consider when dealing with a .NET website. In the next few videos, for the next few days, I'll also be covering some other topics related to SEO inside .NET Nook. Okay, thank you very much. Bye for now.